The Indiana State University student who falsely claimed to have been raped on campus is sentenced today. 19-year-old Erin Conley claimed she met a man selling magazines on campus and he later raped her in her dorm room. But the story turned out to be false. News 10's Amanda Jarrett talks with Conley about the ordeal and what she has to say to the ISU campus. Whoever I pass on campus or, or wherever, I feel like they could attack me too. Claiming she was afraid to be on campus after reporting she was raped. That's what Erin Conley told News 10 just after telling police about an elaborate sexual assault. But once police narrowed in on a suspect on campus, Conley said it was all a lie. We caught up with Conley after her sentencing for giving false information to police. Why did you fabricate the story? It was just a mistake. There's nothing really more I can say about it. A mistake that nearly marked one man as a rapist. I made a mistake and I do regret what I did. And the only thing I can do is say sorry and apologize. Officials say her false report led four officers on a two-day investigation. And that's not all. The judge mentioned, you know, this is probably going to discourage other women. How does that make you feel as a woman? Awful. Very awful. Conley has a message for the campus community. I'm very remorseful for what I did, and I understand how much I've hurt a lot of people. Because of her false claim, Conley will be on probation for a year and serve 60 hours of community service. In Terre Haute with photojournalist Cody Murphy, Amanda Jarrett, News 10.